Good day, lords and ladies, and welcome back to Grifflands with me, Cornish Knight, as we play Rook. And we are getting through the second day. Current progress 25%. Watch our mission. Stop the rampaging automac. Yeah, that's gonna be fun. We're hurt a tad. How drunk are we? Do I want to get more slashed? No, we've. Man, we've already got a lot of cards. Okay. Got 14 metal. Okay. Alright, one person has died because of us. Who was a raider? A lot of people love us. Okay. Um, I want to get the 15 if I want to get the thing that I need. Uh, here we go. You put a dig aside and find small contingents of barons holding a perimeter around the main pit. All is quiet, but the faint chirp carnal smell as hangs in the air. Hinting at recent violence. Yes, so, you are the attaché that aren't promised. I'm much, much fancier tight when I'm used to. Most folks just call me Grifter and try not to make eye contact. I'll call you whatever you want if you can get us out of this uh, situation. I do enjoy a challenge. Where is the device? The device is currently at the bottom of the pit, probably recharging for another attack. Please see to it. Yeah, we're going to have to try and get him to help us. Aaron sent me to help. But I can't do this by myself. I've already lost three people in a mech. My quarterly report is going to be hard enough to square as is. You ex you're the expert, you go do the job. Let me break down the cost benefit for you. Start a battle with any support you won at your side. Okay. Okay, choose two cards to discard. Okay. Let's do that. Right, we need to get people on side. They're going to be hitting this voice of the people, target opponent argument. Right, let's first absorb that, and then we are going to. Choose a card to repair. Okay. We need to get some stuff on side. Okay, so that's taking my stuff. Oh man, this sucks. Right, we need to break something. First things first. Um, let's... Do this. We would then smash that. Which we get the mech on side. They don't have any health bars. Um, five to seven. That should work. I'm going to try and focus this down on one as well. We could take a hit. Ouch. They're going after that argument. Problem is if they destroy that, it's really bad. I don't have any way to rig it though. Prepare a card. Oh, that's if it's prepared. Okay. Now let's let's smash this out of the way. Choose a card to prepare. Oh, 
I want as many people on the field as I can get helping me. Okay. So they're going after the straw argument, so we need to get rid of that. Um... I should have probably not done that, I didn't get enough things. This is going to be painful, I pressed the wrong card. Um, get that and some metal. Fine, take some of my assets. You signal for the volunteers to approach the pits, holding your personal responsibility for any of their losses. You walk towards the pits and peer over the edge. You see a faint glow deep in the bowels of the bog. You pick up a small rock and throw it in. There is a rush of hot air as the mech rises from the deep. New target detected. This is gonna, yeah. We, I wish we'd had more people. Okay, so it's got Mark, Rook can charge his empty cells. Charge can be used to send cards, but there's no charges. When you attack this target, gain one charge and reduce it. Okay, he's got gains four defense at the end of every turn. The six defense at the end of turn. Metallic, immune to bleed and wound, and flame cannon. Automator's boss of multi attack applies burn unless mitigated. Okay. Uh, well, let's get some charge up. And then we'll go. So we're gonna do for now. Yeah, it's fine. Oh boy, that's fantastic. They've only got, they've only got so much health, which is okay. But even so, so who's hitting me? That one's hitting me. Okay. So he's hitting that one down there. So we need to get. Whenever you spend charge, you gain defense per charge. Um, he's got some defense up. Okay, that's dead. Hitting me. Oh, I can't do anything this turn. Okay. That thing's dead. So we need to do something. Okay. It's going to call in reinforcements. Okay, we need to turn damage now to it. Uh, 
Um, can't be hurt by bleed. Yeah, it's calling in reinforcement, just a pain. Right, okay. Let's get this up. They're all attacking. Why aren't they attacking? Okay. Who am I getting bit by? That one, okay. Uh, mitigate some of the damage. So we're all getting smacked up a lot. He's going after that one. Um, so let's try and... Lower the, lower the score a bit, shall we? Make sure that it dies. That's my one. I'd be really annoyed. No, so they're they're all going. That thing's just smacking into me now. Okay. Everything else is going to be basically put into the blender. Yep. Okay, so he's... I'm gonna take damage this turn unless we block. Okay. It sucks. Okay. We took a bit of damage, but not enough to, for what I was hoping for. They're all really pounding on me. I'm going to take some damage, there's no helping that. Okay. Let's try and mitigate some of it. That's dead. Let's do this. Okay. Let's trigger our flourish. Okay. Probably not the best time to do it. He's got to take damage unless I do something to help him. He's hitting me for eight. I can take that damage. Um... And then let's return the favour. Right, he's coming after me again. Right.
man, I'm taking a ton of damage. Right. He's immune to it, but it will break through his armor. Oh, it was supposed to break through his armor. Okay. immune to damage and like attack everyone which is really bad right okay he's immune to damage let's apply a card okay So we're going to take a ton of damage from these these guys unless we kill that thing. It's still up. Killed my dog. Okay. That one's coming after me, is it? Okay, fine. a 50-50 chance that it's killed my dog or it's just caused me a ton of pain. Okay. Got a battle card. Piercing and all damage put by defense. That's really good. Negotiation card. This card gains one damage every time you gamble. That's really good. I do need to take some of these cards out, but we'll lose some once some of these things go. That leveled up. Fully charged this card. Yep. Right, earn metal, new battle card, and resolve so the automatic force of the ground. It's control circuits in Pearl's ground boot. You have my respect, Grifter. Thank you for lending me a hand, or at least hands of others. Our rent to rise at the scene, always summoned by your victory. I command you for your master gift, Grifter. It's called the in the art, art cross when some cranky old automate gets the best of me. Are we square now? We are square even enough that I will permit you to continue to draw breath, but I still do not trust you. Don't fall over, all over yourself expressing gratitude now. I'm not without gratitude. Here, take this trinket in payment. Pick a grift. Okay. It's uh, all battle stuff. Really? Max health. Gain one accent at the start of your turn. Enemies are no longer panic. You can choose to win battles if the enemies panic. A fighter with panic cannot act. You you can choose to win battles if all enemies panic. All fighters with panic cannot act. So I'm just thinking. So this one gives us an extra accent, but the enemies know so long as from panic. Gain one accent at the start of your turn. Take three damage at the start of every turn. Ugh. Gain a one accent at the start of your turn. Battle cards upgrade with multiple upgrades now have one options fewer. 
That actually might be nice. But what would I take out for it, though? Um. Yeah, I'm gonna take out this one. Oh, it's hard to do. I'm gonna take out the pet health. The pet health is nice. Um, but my pet is still alive. Uh, it's always so hard to choose. We could just take the money. I might just take the money and get my um, slots expanded. Felomo, trust you, but no, but we both know ill considered most citizens are. I'll be watching you, Griftus, so you you watch yourself. Orient motions for her goons to attend to the mess and tends to leave. We still have our pet. We have 16 metal. Right. Same spiel. Right. Six are available. So we can unlock a new, f a new um, prestige. Okay. So what do you want? Battle Floris or Negotiation Floris? Um... Hits all enemies with flourish, apply it, burn, gain charge until you are fully charged, then spend all your charges. Spend all your charges, then gain charges until your flourish is fully charged. That's not so bad, what's these ones? Discard any number of cards and draw that many cards. For the next two turns, gamble once after every card you play. Change your coin and Change your coin until the end of negotiation. For the next two turns. Uh, that one's quite nice. That's okay, as long as we're not fighting robots, which we are. Gain charge until you are fully... Gain charge until you are fully charged, then spend all your charges. Spend all your charges, then gain charge until you are fully charged. So the difference between this one is... You gain charge until you're fully charged and spend all your charges. And this one is you spend all your charges and gain charge until you're fully charged. Okay. Gain 6 concentration and 12 and 10 defense. Uh, concentration increases our damage and defense well is defense. Um, hmm, I'm probably going to go with this one. Which basically means for the next two turns, gamble once after every player card, so we can play a lot of cards. Right. And then spend metal. We got 16 of the stuff. So, recover resolve after every battle, recover health after every negotiation, that's quite nice. Battle graphs start with bonus XP, negotiation graphs start with bonus XP. Flourish gain from dealing damage to combat is increased. Okay. Increase max health of pet. What do we want? I probably want to go with recover health after every negotiation. Um, that one looks to be particularly good. Resolve isn't too bad. We can get resolve back without too many things quite quickly. But health is our bigger health bar. So we'd rather be able to boost that. Right, so we get free health back after every successful negotiation. Okay. Let's go to the black market. And shop. Let's go in negotiation, Griff. So let's get that. Gain max resolve, which is nice. Duplicate the first argument you create at every negotiation. Every fifth time you gamble, gain an action. That's really nice. How much is that? 280 shills. We can just afford that. Or... Actually, that's really better. That's having better than having more things. So we'll grab that. Okay. Done. Spent all my money doing it.
We're back in base. Rest in the back. Now about that fine accommodation you so graciously offered. I'll go wake up the cockroaches. Charming. Hebel sold you to the room. Bed calls you to sleep. Our dogs hurt. Dream of barren wasteland and things that were buried beneath the cracked turf. Okay, that's all gone. You always you open your eyes for a new day, at least this one doesn't come with a new name and identity too. The dog's all healed up. Herbel grunts like a grease fire as you approach. Package came for you. Who left it? Don't leave a name, just the package. You have shrewd eyes in there somewhere, Habel. I'm sure of it. Just take it before it explodes. It's be, it'll be bad for business. Habel resumes his duties, making sure to keep the bar between himself and the package. Open the package. Hmm, not explosion. This must be my lucky day. Inside you find a bundle of loose papers and a note addressed to you in a complex cipher. Ne no, none, neither less, the years... Of training have allowed you to grasp most of the work at a glance. Candidate device located. Deep bog, rumoured hermetic faction. The next portion requires more clear translation, but after a moment of study in, in its meaning unfurl, unfurls before you. Secure loyalty of one of your contacts using the enclosed intelligence. Either one of them should know more about about these boggers. The intelligent file the intelligence file reveals it's revealed the location of a bogger encampment implies they found a large cat fated technology. This is the kind of lead that either the barons or the rise would likely kill for. Okay. Open world map. Here we go. So we can either take this Um to the bog or we can take it to him. Felomo, act on his intelligence, you might be able to, to tag along. The thing is, like... The thing is, like, the thing with revolutions, historically, is that they're all fun and dandy when they sort of start going, especially, like, people's rights and all this kind of stuff. Unfortunately, they very quickly get hijacked, especially if the people leading them dies. So I'm reluctant to side with them. Yeah, yeah these guys are nasty. But yeah, I don't know. I don't know who to side with. We'll have to see. That is for next time, though. I've been Cornish Knight. This has been Grifflands. Um, the the rock. Oh, sorry. The um, rook. That's not rook. What is it? Is it? Is it rook? Um. I can never remember our character's name in this. Um. Well, basically, I think it's um the rook story. Storyline, and I shall see you all again next time. Good bye, folks.